everyone welcome to my channel god bless you How have you been doing hope oh, good praise god today i'm here with great word for those who have been praying for children be you a man or a woman the doctor has given the report about you that there's something wrong with you that you cannot have children i'm here for you today let's pray and get started father in jesus name we just worship you we adore you we thank you because oh god you always give us listening ear and we know god you love us so much we have come to hear your word i pray your word will make faith rise up in the years in jesus name amen praise god let's look at the book of hebrews 11 3 through faith we understand that the words we are framed by the word of god so that things which are seen we are not made of things which do appear yeah you saying that's true faith we understand that the word this world we are living in right now this world you see right now the earth the the sea the trees everything the fishes they were all made by the word of God. So, so that things which are seen, so the things that you see now with your eyes, the things you see now, the fishes, the trees, the animals, everything you see now, we are not made of things which do appear. We are not made of the things that were already there, that do appear, that were already there. Praise God. They were not made from the things that do appear, the things that were already there, you know like maybe i want to make something out of this flower or then it's already here then i make something out of it or i want to make something out of this phone i'm holding or wherever or something out of um out of uh, a wood or make something out of a substance you already have with you it was not so the things that you are seeing now we are not made from the things that do appear they were not made from the things that, that were already visible. They were not made from anything. They were made from the word of God. By faith, such a true faith we understand that the words were framed. This world were framed by the word of God. So that by the way I was it framed by the word of God, by the spoken word of God. By the word of God. Hallelujah. Let's look at the book of Hebrews 11, 11. Through faith also, Sarah herself received strength to conceive seed. Hallelujah. How did Sarah receive strength to conceive? Through faith. Are you there? The doctor has told you you cannot have children. That you cannot, that there's something wrong with you. I cannot, cannot produce sperm for a man or your sperm is, uh, is too, is weak. You are a woman. You, are, you say you are barren. The things I seen now were no memory things that are visible. You don't need that doctor's report to, to be able to have children. You don't need that doctor's report that is already seen to create fertility in you. You don't need that doctor's report that the, the, the scientists have, machin machinery have seen in you to create fertility in you. You don't need it. You need the spoken word of God. Hallelujah. That's all you need. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. True faith also Sarah herself received strength to conceive seed and was delivered of a child when she was past age. She was what? Past age. That's equal to the doctor's report. When you are too old to give birth to children. That Sarah being past age is the same thing as the doctor's report. But what happened? Through faith, she received strength to conceive. Hallelujah. And was delivered of a child when she was past age because she judged him faithful who has promised today judge god's faithful who has promised praise god today judge god's faithful faithful who has promised you that there will be no barren in the land judge him faithful put away the thoughts report are you a man they were told you not, cannot give birth are you a woman you were told you cannot give birth Put away the doctor's report god does not need it to create a baby in you god does not need to create a baby in your in your wife God does not need the doctor's report to make you get pregnant. God does not need the doctor's report to make you have babies. He doesn't need it. He only needs his spoken word and you have babies. Man shatter Kaaba Center. In the name of Jesus. Anyone watching me right now that won't be able to have children for years or for whatever time. Receive your children now. In the name of Jesus. By the spoken word of God. Conceive. Conceive. In the name of Jesus Christ. Those doctors reports don't matter. They don't count. We don't need it. We don't God doesn't need it. We don't need it. Receive. Conceive in Jesus, in Jesus' name. Conceive in Jesus' name. Receive your babies in Jesus' name. Receive your children in Jesus' name. 
I declare and declare that you are having that faith right now. And you are counting him faithful who has promised. You are counting him faithful who has promised. In the name of Jesus. I declare and declare that your faith will not fail you. And by this time next year, you will testify and come out with your baby to dance in church to the glory of the living God. In the name of Jesus Christ. You are there looking for children for years. Or I don't care whatever time. Receive now your children right now. <sighs> but I spoke the word of God in Jesus' name. Amen. You are blessed. I decree by next year, this time next year, you will bring your babies and testify and bless the Lord. Because God does not need the daughter's report to do anything. We don't need it. But I spoke the word of God. He said, not to be barren in the land. You have your babies in Jesus' name. Say bless until I come your way again. Subscribe to my channel for more of God's words. Stay blessed. Love you. Thank you.